Hello newbies, this is Suspect Amy here and here's a quick video asking the question Cowell, where are your shards? This year we had a few free units like Titus, 2B and Selma who were all fairly easy to get to EX120 during their event periods. This was either due to New Year mock tokens, lengthy event periods, or conveniently being handed exactly the amount of shards you need through the quests. However, Cowl is a bit different. He is a free UR unit where, if you do everything perfectly during his event period, you will end up way short of the amount of shards needed for EX120. Let's dive into it. Remember, you need a thousand shards to take Cowell to EX120 and his banners last one week while his shops last two weeks. To start with, the easiest shards you can get are the 120 shards from doing his event quests. Then you get another 120 shards from doing the 2EX event quests. You can get 5 shards for 60 paid visitor, which is roughly a dollar per day from his shop. If you do this for 14 days, that's another 70 shards. You can spend 25 million gil every day to get 10 shards from summoning on his guild banner. Do this for 7 days and that's another 70 shards. You can spend 10k free visitor in his shop and snag a cool 200 shards. Doing his character quest will net you another 15 shards. Doing his hard quest will get you 5 shards up front, but you can farm this daily over the next 14 days to score 33 total shards. Point your chocobos at the Ravine of Gales area and spend speed tickets during Fever to try and land another one shard per day. That will be 14 shards during his event period. Add Cowl to your guild barracks and put him on shard mode to nab another 2 shards per day. If you make sure there is enough food in stock over the next 2 weeks, that's total 28 shards. While his store is active, you can pop the Whimsy Shop and Spam Shop refreshes daily and hope to get his shards there. You should be able to easily score at least 10 shards per day doing this. If you add that up over 2 weeks, that's another 140 shards for 7k visitor. And there you have it, 810 shards. No login bonus, no event bonus, no bingo board, no event mission shards, no daily purchase bonus, no select your shard ticket. You are still 190 shards short of getting him to EX120. Granted, there is another pack of 120 shards in his shop for the crazy high price of 6,000 paid visitor, but that's strictly whale territory there. If you have been playing the game for a while, I'm pretty sure you can snag 50 of his shards per day for rainbow medals from the mock shop once you get him to level 99. However, if you are a new player and not a big spender, this is where you would slow build his remaining 190 shards. You can continue farming the barracks, hard quests, chocobo and weekly elemental shops to get him to EX120 around 32 days after his event ends. Should you be upset about this? I don't think so. He is still a free UR and he is actually summonable and farmable after his event period ends, unlike the other free units we received this year. He is one of the few URs in the game without a limit burst and it's not like Wind is the hot meta right now, so you don't need him urgently for your team. I would relax, take a deep breath and slow build him for the future. 
If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe so I can keep doing these types of things. Bye everyone!